he was going to be all right. They, they'd only rent it off him. Uh, they wouldn't buy it. Yeah. He thought he was going to be all right because when he when it came back after the war, he thought he'd get all the hangers and everything. There'd be three phase electricity and they could you know, use them. For <laughs> he thought he was on till we No, no. no they only, only give him the land back. Yeah. And half of that was covered with concrete. So. <laughs> yeah. yeah. No, they, um, they basically were in this... Uh, 
He couldn't go back to the farm anyway because uh, one of the aircraft crashed near to the farmhouse and the resulting shockwave from the explosion actually made it structurally unsound. Yeah, yeah. So the house was demolished. The buildings were still there until a few years ago, yeah. but the house was demolished. I think it was demolished before the end of the war. Yeah, yeah. yeah I said it was... Um, <laughs> said that uh, when these things crashed, he said quite often they were like, like, you see all those bits and pieces you've got in the museum, he said quite often they were all, yeah. there weren't that very many big pieces left. No, no, very little, yeah. and especially if there's still had a load on. Yes. Um, so they did try and drop the, them, the, but if, the you the have up, yeah. if you have problems getting rid of them. Uh, the bomb we have in the far side, it's got both the American and the British uh, way of, of attaching them to the aircraft, right. so it didn't matter which where it went, which airfield it went to, they could still use that bomb. And the British one had a hook on the front, and a clip on the back, and sometimes the clip would, uh, wouldn't release. And yeah, a lot of the boys had to, it, it, or it did release, and the front one didn't. And it would be hanging underneath the aircraft, and they'd have to try and shake it off and all the rest. But if you couldn't get it off, you're flying by the seat of your pants. So you'd, you'd be coming down with this thing still dangling under your aircraft. He does tell the story about one aircraft that crashed actually on top, uh, in top of it, and then it came down. It took the roof up about three or four houses in the main street. Yeah. This one old boy was still asleep and woke up in the morning to, <laughs> to look up and uh, see, find there was the sky there. He slept right through the crash. <laughs> One sound sleeper. But he said they, they used to have um, they used to have an old bullnose Morris uh, car. My grandfather and um, petrol was rationed in the world. Yeah. Couldn't, couldn't, couldn't. Anyway, um, he watched them filling one of these uh, bombers up, the fuel barrels that came, and uh, the guy got up onto the wing and flipped, flipped open all the lids because that's where the cap yeah. fuel was in the wing. And uh, he got up, and then um, the, the guy on the, the the lorry threw a rope and he pulled the hose up and he set it going and shouted down and set it going and then without stopping he would walk to the next tank and so all this fuel was running off the back of the wings so my grandfather said if you're going to throw some fuel away, <laughs> throw it in my direction throw it in my direction so, uh, bring some jerry cans mate we'll pull you up so he put it in, put it in the bullets morris he couldn't go down the road in anything other than first gear because it was aviation that's yes. right yeah poor old car was screaming it's nuts off yeah yeah, 100 octane. Yeah. She probably almost burned the seats out, but yeah. yeah. So yeah. what do you reckon yours is? 1890-ish. Yours is? Yeah. Well, yeah. you know, you can't, you can't really tell which... <laughs> <laughs> so what have you done with this top? This piece of tube, then, is they've slit it, haven't they? Or is it, or is it two halves that have been braised together? Hmm? It's present tubing. It's called present tubing. So it's actually rolled. As a, yes. as a semi-circle. Uh, yeah. A special feature is diamond shaped electronics of novel construction called a special And have you restored it? No, no, Tony, Tony Pickle restored it. So at this point here, do you know whether or not that's one tube that's then been split or has it been raised, two tubes raised together? <laughs> I think, actually, I think it's two right. tubes braced together because I can see a little sure. witness line just there. Yeah. Well, I'll show you this. Look. Yeah. I didn't know if he'd seen you. Right on the old Star Hustle, 1977. And Romney Falcons. Oh. Yeah. And that's 1997 when I won the championship. Yeah. <laughs> I've just bought an old bike. It's an, 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 uh, it's an aerial model uh, E, 1928. Ooh. Ooh.